uh, action. Quiet on set. Okay. Hey, so my daughter and I've been talking about dreams and videos lately, and she's talked about how videos have inspired her from random people halfway across the world. And some of them have said, I don't even know why I recorded this, but it spoke to her. So by the same token, I don't know why this would be important to anybody, but just in case it's for you, we wanted to invest our time in recording it so that God could lead you to it to encourage you. Encourage you. So last night, I had a dream that uh, opening scene, I'm in, standing in the church and my pastor walks up and says, well, you're here early. And I looked down and I was in my pajamas at church and I was so embarrassed and I said, oh my gosh, I forgot to get dressed this morning. I've never done that before. And then the next scene, I'm out in my car and I'm holding an iPad that belongs to another lady. Mm -hmm. It's kind of green with pink writing on the iPad, and I was worried about getting it back to her. Then I drive to a store to get something, and when I come out, I cannot find my car. And I look everywhere for it, and mm -hmm. I can't find it. And I saw two guys outside, one of whom I knew, and I said, please, you've got to help me find my car. It's in a church parking lot. And so we went to a couple of different ones, and I couldn't find it very easily and then um, my phone rings and it's uh, one of my sister's friends and she says where are you and she said even so and so wouldn't do this indicating I'd left my daughter at the church and she was only like 12 or 13 years old talking about me yeah, I'm the daughter um, I left her at church and I was in a hurry to find my car so I could go pick her up at church and um, so I, these guys were helping me to find my car. And I woke up before I, before I found the car, but I felt confident that with them driving me around, I was going to find it. And that's the end of my dream. When you had, Hope it, you said you were, you think you might have remembered one of the guys in the dream. You were, I knew one of the guys, and I, the other one was familiar, but I didn't, couldn't think of his name. So, um, you remember one of them, didn't you, or one something? Of them like, might have been. Was named Mike. Okay. Um, and you came and told me this dream out of nowhere this morning, right? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, because we'd been talking about dreams, so I said, "Oh, hey, I had a dream last night that I remembered." I don't usually I haven't been dreaming a lot lately. I haven't been remembering dreams, so maybe it wasn't for me. Maybe it was for you. So if it if it was, I hope it. Um, lets you know that God sees you and he's speaking to you through other people and has led you to this dream. Right. Okay. <clears throat> and we pray in the name of Jesus that this video is covered by the blood of Jesus as we've prayed before. And it, whoever has an ear, let them hear. Thank you, Lord Jesus. We do this in honor of you. Amen. <laughs>